Welcome to Dr. Josefina's Way. I am Dr. Josefina Monasterio, fitness expert, weight loss, and success coach. We're doing today part two of the power of self-discipline. Of course, we're gonna have the affirmation of the week, our happy and healthy lifestyle. The beautiful Laura Garridge is co-hosting with me today. But first, let's take our yoga break. Namaste. I'm gonna share with you Every time you do your asanas or you practice your yoga, we, go, we just finish the breathing, so we're gonna go into the relaxation pose or called savasana. And every time that you do an asana, in this, in this case, we just finish with the breathing. Now we're gonna relax. And it's called savasana. Your legs apart, your arms apart, and you just let your body relax. This is an is phenomenal, like if you feel stressed out, you feel like the world is coming to you and you feel like, oh my God, I cannot take it anymore. And when you're in this pose, it's almost like you're dead for the life in a good sense. And it allows you to rejuvenate, to calm down, to align your thoughts with your physical body. It's just very good. Okay, now, every time now we're gonna show, I'm gonna share with you another wonderful asana. No, with yoga, you're not only gonna benefit from the flexibility, which is phenomenal, especially if you're an active, active person and you don't wanna have injuries, whether you play golf or you play tennis or you are a runner, whatever sport you do, the flexibility is phenomenal in, in the yoga practice because it, does, it really prevents you from a lot of injuries. And I, I attribute my lack of injuries in my, in my active life because I do my yoga every single day. So let's work in some flexibility, which I think is crucial for everybody. So let's start with the bend, uh, forward bend, okay? It's awesome because this is gonna help you with your lower back, your legs, legs together, upper body nice and straight. We bring the arms up to the sky, and you're always reaching up to the sky and everything, and bending forward, and relax. Now, if you only can get to this level, that's okay, because remember in yoga, you co you're not competing with anybody. So I just kind of flexible because I've been practicing for many years. So you relax and you allow the pose to teach you. And this is what yoga does. It teaches you, you, you listen, and you feel that your body will go lower, and then you relax in the pose and your body will tell you when to really release the pose. Okay, so relax. Slowly. Up, arms up to the sky. Bend forward. Now see, you do it now. I can go a little bit farther. I can go farther than my, my, my feet. But I'm not pushing my body, just the body does it. Because you're stretching, you're stretching your, your, your hamstring, you're stretching your muscles and your back, which one of the things that the benefit of yoga is, uh, in yoga, you are as young as your spinal cord. So if you train your spinal cord and you're always breathing new energy, new blood into it, of course you're gonna, that's why you see people who do yoga, they look so young, they look like 20 years younger. That's the secret, so it's la relax. Slowly. And then, remember, go back to Savasana, relax. 